Okay, uh, it's that time again. I'm asking for help once again. This time I'm looking at getting another 3D printer. Not quite certain which one to go with. I started thinking along the terms of the TiVo Tarantula. Um, seems to be quite a good printer. There's uh, plenty of modifications available for it. Seems to be reasonably uh, well put together. Well, bits and pieces I should say, and you put them together yourself. But then I had a quick look and uh, discovered there's also another one. There's a, an Anet A6. It's around about the same price range. Um, it's slightly different sort of build looking at it. And then we go over again. There's another one, a, a Tron XY. And I uh, don't know much about this particular printer. But sort of looking between the Anet and the Tron XY, they're sort of similar, I suppose you'd say. Then we got a Zone Star. Um, and again, it's um, along the same sort of line, so they, they all look pretty much the same, except for the TiVo Tarantula. So, I'm not particularly worried about the uh, build plate size. They're all around about the same sort of size. I know the TiVo Tarantula, uh, the basic one, has the smallest build uh, plate out of all of them. But you can get uh, a larger heat bed, so it, it goes up to 280, so... That's not too bad. Uh, it'll probably suit my needs quite uh, quite well. But before I sort of uh, decide to get one of these, I would like to hear from you guys, uh, the ones that have actually got these printers or, or perhaps doing research the same as myself, and let me know what you think about them. Uh, am I making a, a good decision or am I wasting my time and perhaps I should look at something else? You know, any advice would be greatly appreciated. The previous video that I was asking about the TiVo uh, Tornado and the uh, Creality, well, I, I, CR10, I should say, I, I finished up with the Creality uh, CR-10S. Uh, that seemed to be the one that everybody recommended that I should get, and I must admit, I am absolutely wrapped. I just can't speak highly enough of it. Very, very happy with the printer. Excellent printer, in fact. Uh, now I just need something a little smaller and something I can tinker with something I can play with, something I can pull apart, and if it breaks, I'm not that worried about. So suggestions, ideas, comments, greatly appreciated. If you think uh, the video is a waste of time, put a thumbs down. You know, I don't give two hoots. I don't care. I mean, all I want is help. I, I'm not asking for anything else. So please, you know, if you have information on any of these printers or perhaps a printer I have not looked at in around about the same price range, Make a comment below, let me know, I will be very, very interested. And again, thank you so much for watching, really appreciate it. And that goes for you girls out there too, I greatly appreciate it. We don't forget you guys and girls, definitely. Thank you, bye.